I'm Zeus, the king of the gods, and he uh, formed, fashioned, created human beings for his pleasure. And with these other gods, the god of war, Aphrodite, the god of love, the god of this, the god of nature, with, by creating human beings, his, his rationale was, these are my little playthings, and if they pray enough, honor us gods enough, we will become immortal. So their food is human prayer. No! And then he learns through his journey that he is a, he is the son of Zeus. He's, he's, he's half God and he decides to fight against it. He wants to be a man and defend himself and go through life as a man and has no respect for these gods. Let me loose upon them. There's an incredible animosity towards, but also this extraordinary kind of love, too, you know? Um, that I think Zeus can't quite contend with. So he has sent him to the underworld because he just doesn't want to confront it. You will kneel before me and beg for mercy! You're a fool. You have no understanding of my power. I've always had an interest in Greek mythology in Arthurian legends from when I was a kid and uh, my eldest boy has studied Greek mythology and likes it very much and it was it was a part of all that it was a part of uh, reading the script and this you know Warner Brothers even considering me for the part and uh, and getting a chance to work with friends and you know, especially Rafe and those great crew. It's like, yeah, how cool can it be, you know? Be on a movie for, I think, my engagement was just two weeks or so, but it's, it's enough to uh, get excited over it. It's, it's terrific. It's a great honor. Gosh, King of the Gods. It's pretty, pretty intense, you know? Release the Kraken! <laughs> 